Hey Las Vegas, David Riedel, Coldwell Banker Premier, your Las Vegas Realtor. I'm here for our brand new 2024 first episode, monthly market update, where we discuss all the new exciting things happening in Las Vegas. You can talk to your friends about it and know what's going on at any given time. Two things that stand out to me is we got a lot of momentum going into this new year. Interest rates are going down, a lot of opportunities for new home buyers. I'm always here if you need representation on that. And also we got the new museum going near Symphony Park. That's gonna be a big addition to our uh, community. And there's the new Cello Towers, which is gonna be absolutely gorgeous. High rise residences at Symphony Park, beautiful building. And so much more is happening right now. Median price, we're still at that 450 range, which is amazing. We have a lot of momentum going into this new year. So check out the monthly market update and make it a great one. Take it away, Bob. Happy New Year. Some unwritten rules state that January 15th is the last time we can say that. But hey, it's the first time I've seen you all year. Hello and welcome to the January issue of the Monthly Market Update. And after we close out 2023 stats, I'll be sharing some housing market predictions for 2024, an exciting new cultural announcement, Las Vegas' next huge event, and 807 million reasons why Southern Nevada's economy will roar in 2024. So let's get started. Las Vegas Realtors Association recently announced that our housing market experienced its lowest sales pace in almost a decade in 2023. A total of 29,000 single family residences and condos sold, the lowest since 2014, and 42% less than the record 50,000 closings in 2021. We ended 2023 with only 4,132 homes for sale, which is over 36% less inventory than in December 2022. And at 1625, over 23% less homes came to market in December versus November. And for the year, 30% less homes came to market versus 2022. Both new sales and new closings were unusually up in December versus November, a positive indication of momentum going into 2024, albeit while total single-family closings for the year were off over 18% from 2022's pace. And against many predictions to the contrary, the median sales price increased almost 6% to just under $450,000 compared to December 2022. It comes as no surprise that the condo townhouse market enjoyed a larger increase in median sales price due to the overall lower sales price and price per square foot compared to the single family market, which caused many single family buyers impacted by higher interest rates to compromise and select this more affordable option. December and January are prediction months, and wow, are there a lot of varied opinions regarding the 2024 real estate market and if you distill them all down, the consensus seems to be that interest rates should drop slightly, while new listings, sales pace, and prices should all increase modestly. I'll see you in 12 months, and we'll see how these predictions play out. But what we don't have to wait to confirm is the dramatic impact of home ownership on Americans' net worth. As Keeping Current Matters recently shared that every three years, the Federal Reserve releases the Survey of Consumer Finances, which compares net worth for homeowners and renters. The latest report shows the average homeowner's net worth is almost 40 times greater than a renter's. And Inman News recently released a report of the top 10 markets where buyers want to buy, and Las Vegas came in at number two. And surprise, our number one relocating market is Los Angeles, and that is likely to continue as SFGate recently shared that the wealthiest Californians are leaving the state, and that is not good for their economy. The article describes how heretofore California's wealthy in-migration offset the lower earning out-migration, but now higher taxes, soaring real estate prices, and increased government regulations have caused the wealthiest residents to relocate for relief. 
And those wealthy relocating Angelinos will be happy to hear that Las Vegas will soon welcome its first art museum as an unprecedented partnership between philanthropist Elaine Wynn and the Los Angeles County Museum of Art will launch a new museum called the Las Vegas Museum of Art a few short steps away from the Smith Center for the Performing Arts in downtown Las Vegas 61 acre prize jewel Symphony Park. And a short walk to both of these cultural icons will be the stunning new residential high-rise for which we proudly exclusively represent Cello Tower at Origin in Symphony Park. Your Coal Banker sales professional can provide details of this very unique offering. Formula One's Las Vegas Grand Prix was Las Vegas' first billion-dollar event. And now, after just welcoming over 100,000 attendees of our most popular convention, CES, it's time for our second billion dollar event, the big American football game that I'm legally not allowed to mention by name being held over the February 9th weekend. And if that's not enough, I promised 807 million reasons why our economy will roar in 24. And while it pales in comparison to 2023's 8 billion in completed construction projects, we'll deliver over 807 million in completed projects from the convention center's first phase of their 600 million renovation to the 350 million renovation of the Rio Hotel's Ipanema Tower to Blake Shelton's 30 million Old Red Music Club and the 50 million bottled blonde nightclub, both located at Horseshoe Las Vegas, the former Bally's Hotel, and so, so, so much more. It's a very long list. Thank you once again for declaring us your real estate company of choice, and you simply must reach out to your Coldwell Banker sales professional responsible for you receiving this video and request the details of all the stories we touched on. Here's wishing you a fabulous start to your 2024, and I look forward to seeing you again in Cupid's Month. Bye-bye.